family members of the victims who were killed during the chaotic U.S. withdrawal from Afghanistan have blamed President Biden's administration for the deaths of their relatives. This came as a report to the U.S. House Committee contended that the administration made the decision to evacuate non-combatants far too late, formally ordering it only in August, and failed to communicate between departments in Washington and among officials in Afghanistan and botched the paperwork for departure of Afghan civilians eligible to leave the country. As the U.S. forces were trying to help Americans and Afghans flee while the Taliban seized control, a suicide attack at the Abbey Gate entrance to Kabul's airport killed 13 Americans, compounding the U.S. sense of defeat after two decades of war. The report is result of a three-year investigation led by Representative Michael McCall. This report is really important to me and my daughters for the following reasons. Um, three years ago tomorrow, September 10th, was the last trip my son Riley took home to Wyoming. The, the, the ramifications of what happened on 8-26-2021, it's not just a ripple effect, it is a tidal wave of the travesty that, that came from that, from that moment. 